down the back of your throat for 10 seconds, then it will be nice for 10 seconds. At the University of Bradford, the sports hall has been transformed into a pop-up mass testing centre. Thousands of students are spending their last few days of term getting tested for COVID before they head home for Christmas. It's safe and simple and the results are quick. We've had a relatively high infection rate within Bradford, but at the university itself and within our student accommodation, we've had relatively low rates. Um, but as you say, still extremely important for people to have the peace of mind that they can travel home to see family, friends, um, and ultimately keep them, them safe. We followed in Shal as he got tested. Under the guidance of trained staff, it's a case of taking a self-swap from the nose and throat. That sample is then placed on a handheld kit, a bit like a pregnancy test, and a result comes back from the NHS within the hour. They potentially could be uh, virus carriers, and, and if they get tested and make sure that their test results come out negative, then by doing that, they're protecting them and their families and people around them. Students are being urged to take two tests three days apart. If they're negative, they're being asked to go home as soon as possible. If they're positive, they must self-isolate for 10 days. And all this mass testing needs to take place by Sunday, the 6th of December. But not all of our region's students are able to take part. Leeds Arts University told us it hasn't been able to access the test due to the logistical pressure the government's facing in providing kit. That's upset some students and their parents who wanted the reassurance of a test before the winter break. The UCU Lecturers Union says the approach has been rushed and confused. But back in Bradford, it's given travelling students peace of mind. I lived with my grandma and with my parents who are a little bit older, so it, it will be good to, know, to, to go home knowing that I will not give the virus to them, I will not um, be a risk to them. After another difficult term on campus, many students are ready to go home. It's hoped the testing will give those with access a safe way of seeing their families this Christmas time. Charlotte Leeming, BBC Look North, Bradford.